Hey guys, welcome back to a new video. Oh, actually, I'm not sure if it'll sound any different or if it's just gonna be the same, but it's the first video I get to make in my new apartment, which I, for a second there, thought moving would literally never end. Like, we were driving down the street and I saw a guy, like, sitting at his, like, couch, I guess. Well, not his couch, but, like, he was sitting on a chair, like, by the window, just looking outside, and I'm like, man, that guy doesn't have a bunch of shit to move right now. Is that ever gonna be me? <laughs> but we're all done. We're finished cleaning up. All the furniture's built and stuff, and, like, it's great. I love it. <laughs> I'm really excited to, like, be able to freely make more videos, I guess, because, oh, there's something I gotta worry about, though. The sound of, like, people walking and because we're right in front of the elevator which is fine but uh yeah i'm just really excited to be able to make more videos and just i don't know because like of course i would always be syncing my videos with when no one was home and that's like four people i gotta you know work around so yeah now i don't have to worry about any of that and i don't know um, <laughs> when i first moved here it was i mean obviously it's because the room was empty but it was like really echoey and I'm hoping that the echo is mostly gone if not all gone like I hope and I I also kind of hope you guys can't hear the wind and the traffic because I feel like that can get really annoying I mean I like it but I don't know if the video will like it but anyway about the drawing this was quite the challenge um it's another commission for Veritas and she wanted me to I designed a character well I didn't design it but I like spiffied up I guess one of her characters and then she wanted me to make a human form and like design the clothes and all that for the character I guess and like that is absolutely by far like one of my weakest weak points like I don't know I just man especially clothes like designing clothes is so hard <laughs> you see all these people who are so good at it with like adoptables and stuff and like just in general in like the furry community I guess like People are just so good at designing clothes, it's crazy. Um, I Now that I've been like challenged into doing it, like I think that it turned out well, but it took me so long. <laughs> and I don't know, I just need to build a better like mental library, I guess, of what I like and what looks good. Cause I kind of avoid this. I'm sure you've noticed that I don't really draw, <laughs> draw clothes all that often. So, like, it's cool if they're pre-designed, like, I can do that no problem, it's just this is, this was a challenge in its own, like, at least she's pretty good at giving, like, like, really solid descriptions, so it's not like I, I was, like, taking a shot in the dark and, like, trying to make a random thing up, so I knew what I was gonna do, but I just, I don't know, um, but it was fun, it was really fun, like, it was kind of nerve-wracking, because, you know, like, the ugly stage of a drawing where you're, like, half done and it's just not I don't know it's just not great like I, I feel like this drawing stayed in that stage for so long um and I guess that could have been a safe bet to like restart but I'm kind of glad I didn't because I don't know like on one hand you can restart and like hopefully hit the mark but on the other hand like if you just keep at it I find most of the time things end up turning out which is what I did, um, and mostly I just, you know, I got it all, like I sketched it obviously, and then I got it all cleaned up, and then I blocked in some colors, and then that started like separating objects, you know, because like it just kind of all turns into one thing. It's, it's something, I tell you. Designing clothes, especially like complicated clothes, not that this is even that complicated, like some of the stuff I was looking at while drawing this is like freaking crazy but uh yeah like I don't know if you complicated outfits and stuff like they can get <laughs> they can get really messy really quickly um and I'm, I'm just gonna hope that the colors aren't too bad because we don't have curtains right now so like it's 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 been it's been a process I, I, I want curtains but also I don't because like the whole wall basically everything on the outside wall is like windows which is really rad, like I really like that. I like the sunlight, it's just bright in here and feels so open, I don't know. And I, so I don't really wanna put curtains over it, but also I'd like to see my computer. 
in, in the TV and shit, you know, like, oh, but you can always open the curtains, I don't know. I'm excited for the summer, like, there's a patio door and, like, I just feel like there'll be, like, a sick breeze, I don't know, and it's high enough, like, we're kind of more in the middle of the city than we were, but it's, I feel like it's high enough up to not smell like freaking car exhaust, because if there's one thing that I hate the smell of, it's car exhaust. Um, but yeah, I don't know. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoy this. Um, I was debating whether or not I should use this as a video, but like I kind of have to because this whole thing took so long and I just need something to put out because I have to study. Like, I've been blown off the Japanese and it's not good. I gotta study. Got lots of words to learn and lots of grammar to learn and lots of katakana to learn. So, yeah, I gotta get on that. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video as much as I enjoyed making it. It was a challenge, but I did enjoy it. Um, and I'll see you guys next week. <laughs>